One in five of the world's 380,000 plant species is threatened with extinction and human activity is doing most of the damage, according to a global study published this past week. Scientists from Britain's Botanic Gardens at Kew, London's Natural History Museum, and the International Union for the Conservation of Nature found that more than 22 percent of species were endangered, critically endangered, or vulnerable. Elmir Nick Lugada, head of science policy and coordination at the Millennium Seed Bank in England, spoke to reporters. The picture that comes out of the survey is, is rather bleak, I'm afraid. One in five of our plants is threatened with extinction. Why is that? Well, most of it is down to human activity. Um, over two-thirds of the, of the threats that we've identified to the plants that we assessed as threatened, those plants are threatened by things that humans are doing. Humans are clearing land for agriculture. They're collecting particular plants because they like to use them. They're often damaging other plants as collateral damage when they're collecting particular plants. They're still logging, of course. We're losing large tracts of rainforest still. As this was the first time a global analysis of the threat to the world's plants had been undertaken, the scientists say it would serve as a baseline to measure conservation efforts. Both common and rare plant species were assessed to try to give an accurate picture of how plants were faring around the world. Since assessing the threat to all the world's estimated 380,000 plant species would be too enormous a task, the researchers say they studied a random sample of about 1,500 species from each group. We all rely on plants for the air we breathe, the food we eat, even if you're not vegetarian, all your food comes directly or indirectly from plants, uh, for the water we drink, and also for the environment that we live in.